Ben Austin, and I'm a print and multimedia journalism major. It's really an amazing school. It's such a small school, but it's right in the heart of such a big city uh, that you get to experience basically everything you're going to want to. There's always something going on, uh, and even though it's a small school, I think that it, it has its own personality and it really it grows on you. At first I was a little, I didn't know how much I would like it, uh, but, but once I got here it was just amazing. The experiences you get from living in downtown Boston are great. Starting out when, when I was a freshman and sophomore, going to classes that covered started out covering like one department in Emerson, and so it starts out on a small level, and then with beat reporting we went out and covered an entire neighborhood in the city. We also had history classes and law and ethics classes earlier on, so that you kind of get that fundamental background. Uh, for journalism and, and the laws, the e actual ethics that, that people have to follow. And now, being a uh, junior and senior um, in the last two years, they send you out more to do actual stories to, to write for Boston.com. Uh, in particular, right now I'm doing the class that the whole point of the class is to write for uh, a section of Boston.com. And so my professor's been basically the editor. He's kind of the connection between us and the editors over at, in the Boston Globe office. It's been a good opportunity to be able to just directly right through the class, right for an actual publication. There's just so many opportunities coming in as a freshman that you can just jump right into, from uh, just grabbing a camera and going to, to do a video package, or being on television shows. Professors will send you up to the State House to do a profile on, on state senators, state representatives, and it's really just amazing to immerse yourself in, in Boston right in the middle of, of everything that's going on. It also gives you a good opportunity to uh, get internships, uh, I, I think that I've gotten a lot of internships and work because I go to Emerson. I had a, an internship for over a year with Boston.com in the travel section uh, and, and arts and entertainment sections, which was a great opportunity, I think, because it was, while I was still a college student, I was going in every day, I had my desk at, the, uh, at my office uh, over at the Boston Globe, and was just able to see exactly what goes on in the newsroom every single day. Being in Emerson, obviously, the extracurriculars are huge. The extracurriculars have given me, whereas my major is print journalism, the extracurriculars have given me the opportunity to be on air, on radio, to be on air on television, and to write stuff that I never would be able to do in a, in a normal class setting. You can, like I did with some friends sophomore year, uh, start a radio show, be your own producer, and, and be the, the host of the show and the producer, and it's, it's kind of up to you to be able to, to explore, and, and so we've been able to make, a group of us have been able to make a lot of radio shows. I've also done uh, some of the sports debate shows that they have on the Emerson Channel. Uh, for a few years I've done Unsportsmanlike Conduct, which is a great uh, sports debate show. I recently joined the Hyena group, which is a, a comedy group. It's, it's you write um, comedy journalism, which is something I never thought I would really be into. It just lets me explore a completely different side of journalism, that um, the more humorous side of journalism, and, and still learning things about uh, situations going around on campus, but then also making them kind of satirical and, and making people laugh about them. And I think that being at Emerson and, and Having the experience that I've had here makes me, it makes it a lot easier for me to get into those kind of things because I think I'm a more versatile journalist because I've been able to cover those things here at Emerson.